In this video I'll be demonstrating how to use Runway for UAV operations. To get started, open the Play Store app, search for Runway and download it. Once installed, open Runway, select Sign In and enter the user ID provided to you. The first time Runway opens, you'll be prompted to select a region. In this case, we'll select Australia and press OK. Use the Map button down the bottom to select the map you want to view. We recommend using the Hybrid VFR. The Hybrid VFR combines every Australian WAC, VNC, VTC and INSET. As you zoom in on the Hybrid VFR, the VNC becomes visible to give you more detail, followed by the VTC and any INSETs. Zooming in on an area not covered by a VNC or VTC will continue to show the WAC. You can download maps and documents onto your device so that they can be accessed without an internet connection. To do this, select the context button, then select downloads and Australia. We recommend downloading the Ursa and the Hybrid VFR. If you want to save space, you can download individual maps instead of the Hybrid VFR. Tap the three dots along the left hand edge of the map screen to open the overlay bar. Tap the icons to switch their respective overlays on or off. The solid circle at the top is for larger aerodromes like Adelaide, Melbourne, Mildura, etc. The next one down, the dashed circle, is for smaller fields or ALAs. The circle with the H inside is for helipads. You can mark your own points on the map by creating a user waypoint. I'll use Hallett Cove in this example. Tap on the map over Hallett Cove and select New Waypoint. Enter a code and or a name for the waypoint and tap Save. User waypoints can also be switched off and on using the overlay bar. To access weather and NOTAM information, tap near an airfield on the map, for example Parafield, and select it from the list. Then tap on Quick Briefing. Here you'll be able to see the TAF or META for the airfield and any NOTAMs. Tap on the Airfields tab to bring up a list of airfields Australia-wide. Tap 1 to view any applicable charts. You can also use the search bar to search for a field. Use the folder icon to switch between charts. Tap the weather icon to bring up the location briefing. You can also search for locations on the map screen using the search button. For example, I'll search for Aldinga. and tap recenter here and that will take me to Aldinga on the map. The documents tab contains the front and back pages of the URSA along with runway user guides and various other documentation.
The AIP tab contains the full text of the AIP. That's a brief overview of how to use Runway for UAV operations. If you'd like to learn more, you can view the tutorial videos on our YouTube channel or visit our support website at help.ozrunways.com.